I came to liberation the summer of 2018 after having been part of a, another ministry for over 10 years. For the first time in my life, I found myself needing to find a church home. I was afraid, I was confused, I was hurt, I was embarrassed. I had followed Pastor Jay's ministry on Facebook about two or three years prior to coming. So I was familiar with the vision of loving people, showing kindness, and serving change. And I would remember the little red, yellow, and blue hearts that would occasionally show up on his post. So I visited for several months, and then I made the decision to connect with the ministry. And it, honestly, it's been one of the best decisions of my life. As a member of Liberation, I have begun to see the vision played out in my own life. And I guess I can best describe it with examples. Not long after connecting with the ministry, I was out sick one Sunday. And um, later on that afternoon, to my surprise, my Facebook post, my Facebook uh, inbox were filled with messages, get well wishes, I missed you today. And that meant so much to me. Uh, another example is one member, once she realized we lived close to each other, suggested that we carpool. And from then we started uh, attending midnight prayer together and uh, different events throughout the week. And from that we formed a, a really good relationship. But my most recent example, and perhaps the best example, is about two weeks ago my car quit on me out of nowhere, it just died. But during that time, my family at Liberation made sure I got to church on Sunday. I made it to rehearsals. And I was sharing with one of the members what was going on with my car. He said, let me come look at it. And so one day when he got off work, it was late in the evening, he took time out of his day to come look at the car. And he said, well, I tell you, if you get the part, I'll fix it for you. And he did. I was so grateful because in that one example, I saw someone loving people, they showed kindness and they served change. I am convinced that you should give liberation a try. It's a great ministry. I don't know where I would be today if I didn't have the love and the support of this ministry. I often say no church is perfect, but I think liberation is a great example of how imperfect people can do great things. And I'm so happy to be here. <laughs>